All right, before this video begins, I just want to let you guys know that this video is sponsored by Hero Kentari. Hero Kentari is a webcomic crossover RPG game which features characters from Tower of God, God of High School, and Hardcore Leveling Warrior. You can get the main character from each of these series. You can get Bam from Tower of God, Mori Jin from God of High School, and Hardcore Leveling Warrior from the Hardcore Leveling Warrior webtoon. Each of these characters have their own individual stories so you can experience an epic solo experience with each of the characters. If you download the game now, you get a whole bunch of free rewards. You get all those three main characters for free. You get a uh, 50 essence of dimensions, which gives you a free 10 draw. You get 500k cash, and you get an SS damage weapon, which should give you a really good head start on all your enemies. If you use my link down below, it will take you to a website where you can pre-register. If you pre-register now, you can get a really good head start because you get all these rewards for free. And the game comes out May 26, so please hurry up and register down below. Make sure you use my link and shout out to the dudes over at Hero Kentari. Okay, welcome back to another video. All right, so today we are going to be playing Project X. Project X, everyone's been playing this game. This game has 8,000 players playing. Apparently, it's like a mashup of different animes. I've tried recording a video on this game, like, I think three days ago, but I did something and it pissed me off. Well, something happened and it pissed me off. This game has 8,000 players playing. It's pretty much like the most popular anime game on Roblox, if you don't count um, Anime Fighting Simulator. Anime Fighting Simulator has 24K players. I've tried this game. I hate it. It's a simulator game. You guys know how I feel about simulator games. I, I don't rock with those. Um anime battle simulator uh it's quite different compared to this project x uh it's pretty much like you fight people say project x is like a simulator but i don't know how that works oh god i, I don't know man because like the first time i played this i ran into stuff that just pissed me off these are the game passes uh two times mastery shadow aura shocking aura wait does this do any damage or anything or just just aura it doesn't say anything um yoru and vip what the hell does vip give uh, 20% experience boost, unlimited stat point resets, special VIP or Okay, not bad. Okay, let's try out the game now. Uh, I, I like I said, actually no, let's go to a VIP server. Alright. Okay, we're here. Let's mute this damn music. Alright, so we don't have a character made, do we? Oh, we do. This is what pissed me off. I made my character, I customized it and everything, and I, I put my skin color like, uh, like white or brown or something i don't know what i did i did something and i come in game my skin color is fucking green because i am an elf wraith like fucking goblin race or whatever and it pissed me i'm goblin race that pissed me the hell i'm off. not playing as no damn goblin like i if i play i'm not playing as a race like a goblin like that's just dead like if i come into a game and i see my skin color is green i'm leaving the game instantly like there's just no there's just no no just no i'm not playing as a goblin that is dead that is extremely dead I'm not playing as a goblin, dude. Like, I joined the game. I was fucking green, dude. Reset data. Are you sure? Yes. Reset my damn data, dude. I'm not rocking with that, bro. You are a vermin? A vermin's a rat. I am not playing as a damn vermin. Just give me something normal. Okay, human. There. Holy crap. Like, who? Do, what do I look like playing as a damn vermin? What the fuck? Why is that? I don't even get why that's rollable. Who would want to play as a damn goblin or a freaking rat? Like, are you serious right now? Okay. Let's customize our character real quick. All right, our character is customized. We're done. All right, so this is how our character looks. Hopefully, we don't go th get the same bug. If we get the same bug where we go in game and my character is not how that looks, I'm going to get pissed. I am literally going to get pissed. All right, our character is made. What is this white screen? All right, we press play. Finally, our character looks how we customize the dude. Holy crap. All right, okay, we're ready to continue. Um, all right, uh, so how does this game work? What's the mouse lock key? Uh, is my mouse lock just not on? Oh, it's alt, okay. Um, basically, uh, double tap W does not make you run. How do you run? Pressing every key. What does the V key do? Oh, custom moveset, I don't have anything yet. Beggar's quest, uh, okay my bad uh defeat five beggars okay we're gonna go do that real quick oh it's control to run okay that makes sense uh we're gonna do this quest real quick be right back ability type is combat oh there's codes in this game and stuff that's a fat yikes okay um where are those npcs i was fighting earlier a set spawn location oh there's a chest right here uh, it's kind of annoying feet. how every time i press the right hook key i have to press the run key again oh, wait no i don't i was just bugged i guess oh wait no i got hit Wait, is that what's causing it? That's not what's causing it. What is causing it to stop running? I don't know what's causing it. Oh, well, this one's almost dead. Just that these things melt me. Ability shop? Whoa, one piece. My, what the hell is all this? 
Okay, this is a little of a handful. Okay. Bleach, Black Clover, Other, Storm, Winter, Inferno. What the hell is all this? Gomu, Mera, Goro. What the hell? Zushi. Jesus, dude. Peak. Damn, bro. What is all this? My Hero Academia. Gas. What? what? Why is this the only thing in My Hero? Fairy Tail, Acid Magic, uh, Lightning, Dragon Slayer. Um, we got some Bleach stuff. We got others. I don't know what this stuff is, but... Okay, that's pretty interesting. I can't afford anything yet, of course, but I think I can just probably find some codes to use. Oh, that's what's causing it. Okay, so when you press control and you run... Wait. Oh, okay, so you stop running if you click M1 once. They need to fix that. What the hell? It just feels really clunky. Like, when you're running, you're fine, but then, like, when you click, it stops running. Like, it should st it should slow you down when you're using the uh, M1s, but then, like, it should put you still back into the run uh, animation. Well, it should turn running back on after you're done with the combo. Because it's kind of annoying where I have to keep pressing the run key over and over. Okay, this thing's melting me. Alright, we completed the quest. Okay, we're level 5 now. Let's put some skill points in. Magic power, durability. For sure, this is defense. We need defense. Do this quest all day, so what's the next quest that I can do? Uh, I should probably find some codes first. So I'm gonna check the Discord. 15k likes. Does this code even work anymore? Hey, it works. 15k likes. Alright, so that's WXP, right? Yeah, yeah, okay. Um, what other codes are there? 50k mastery. Uh, look at this. 50k mastery experience. I don't want to put mastery experience on this thing. But I just want to try it out again. <laughs> God help us all. Why is this a code? Redeemed uh, sub to aspect produ productions. 50k mastery XP. I don't want to put mastery on this, but eh, it's whatever. I don't really care. All right, I put on the combat, but I didn't mean to put on the... I probably shouldn't have put on, like, the base combat thing, but who cares? Oh, you can press V to awaken. Ooh, that's pretty cool. Okay, I'm just going to call this base combat that I'm using bot. There's a magic broom, dude. You need to be 4 HP to summon your broom. Right, it's another bandit quest. I think I'm getting to understand why people are calling it, like, a simulator. It's not really, like, a simulator. What the hell? I can't get this quest. Oh, I got to click. Okay. Um, can I get the quest, please? Why is it not giving me the quest? Oh my gosh. I don't know why this quest doesn't work, but okay, it's whatever, I guess. And I think I understand why people are calling this a simulator game. Um, th this game, it I think it follows the same, like, um, it's, it follows the same format. Like, the same format that Blocks Piece, King Piece, like, all those One Piece games use. Like, they do the same format of, basically, you start at one island, you do quest, and, like, you just keep going from island to island, doing quests, leveling up over and over. And just, like, it's just that same format. And then people consider that a simulator now because it's starting to get overused on Roblox now. Like, the same format of constantly just going to island from island to just uh, fighting mobs over and over and then getting stronger and finally going to a different island once you're stronger over and over. It's, it's kind of getting overused. Well, like, at least in the One Piece aspect. In, like, the One Piece community, that's getting really, really outplayed. And, like, people are really using it as, a, like, a cash grab sort of thing. And then they all have this, like, same shop where uh, you can just buy double fruits and stuff. Which is, like, pretty much the shop I just showed you guys earlier. And people are starting to consider that as a simulator game. Because it's the same It's the same concept. It's, it's getting outplayed. Like, I understand what people mean by it's a simulator game. I mean, it's not really like a simulator of, of like, anime battle simulator or um, the other anime simulators that you see on the front page. It's not really like that. It's not that type of simulator, but it's like a One Piece simulator. I, I get what people mean. Like, the concept is played out in the One Piece community. Like, everyone's doing the same format, and, like, it, it's really annoying. Like, I miss the old One Piece formats where, you, like, you just find Doe Fruits and have fun but now people are just using the same format of uh you just buy dough fruits and you just go island to island and level up it's really annoying but hey it's whatever i guess if people want to make money off that they they can go ahead but like i'm speaking facts here dude and how the hell do i get off this damn island uh can i swim i guess i can uh i don't know why that quest is bugged over there but like oh i have a magic broom okay that, that makes sense i should use my magic broom Oh, I can't get out this water, can I? Ooh. I can't get out this water. Wait, I can use a skill, right? Oh, I can't get out the water. That sucks. Okay, they gotta fix that. I don't know why I can't get out the water. Let me see if I can activate my broom in the water. You need a full HP to summon your broom. Oh, we're full HP. Alright, so how does this magic broom work? Uh, wait, what did I just do? Uh, okay, I held G. 
Okay, I'm holding G. Oh, okay, so I just click and it just goes in that direction. Okay, but as I was saying, I understand what people why people wouldn't like this game. Like, uh, I don't mind it, I guess, as long as the game's fun. I mean, it makes for good content. Like, that's why you see a whole bunch of YouTubers making videos on this game. It makes for good content. I'm not sure if those YouTubers actually enjoy the game, though. I mean, me right now, I'm just like, this is like my first time playing the game, so I can't really, like, say if I like this game or not. Um, it's, it's fine, I guess, but it's probably not a game I'd play, like, a lot, unless I'm just, like, looking for, like content to make videos on or i don't know dude but uh it's, it's it's basically like one of those games set spawn all right let's set our spawn here i mean there's nothing wrong with that of course but hey uh what the okay let's go up here let's search for like a little quest what is this this is definitely like i definitely don't mind uh the concept though but it, it's definitely getting overplayed and this game like makes it different what the fuck i got one shot this game makes it different because uh it has like a whole bunch of different categories in one like it has different animes in one instead of just usually the the same one piece and then like the same format i mean it's the same format but it's it's not like just one piece so that, i guess that's what makes it like different from the rest i guess or i don't know but it, it's definitely that concept is what's pissing people off and making people annoyed uh, let me know what you guys think about this down below in the description well not in the description in the comments section of this video uh, like do you like this concept do you guys think that this concept's getting played out on roblox or like what do you guys think about this concept like i mean i don't mind it personally but it, it's definitely getting overplayed like in my opinion it, it's definitely getting overused like more people are starting to use it over and over and it, it seems like a cash grab so that, that's why people call it a simulator like you gotta think of when they say cash grab they think simulator and when i think simulator i think cash grab like anyone with a brain would i guess well not with a brain but like it's it's an opinion based thing but i guess anyone anyone that like plays m multiple anime games on roblox wouldn't wouldn't just know that i don't know dude i'm probably sounding really head ass here but hey i, I don't know dude <laughs> you get what i mean if you don't get it hey you don't get it. i think i go back to starter island because all these quests uh i'm too low level to be doing so I'm just gonna go back to the starter. I'll tell you what, I like this free magic broom system. This free magic broom system is pretty nice. I like that. I like the fact that they just gave you a free magic broom, so it won't be tedious of you flying across the map or like trying to get across the map with like boats. I like the fact that they rewarded you guys for uh, well, they didn't. They, they rewarded you guys for nothing basically. <laughs> like they didn't want it to be like tedious to the point where oh, I have to sail to every island unless I have like a dough fruit that like gives me like a uh, flying abilities or some power. So that's pretty good. It, it, it's pretty good in my opinion. I really don't want to farm this level one quest till I'm level like 20. That's kind of annoying, but because like that quest over there is bugged. I, I don't think there's anything I can do about it. What is this? Do I have freaking hockey or some crap? What What is this noise? It's like my aura charging. Or, I don't know what this is. I like the fact that this thing has awakenings. <laughs> Wait, do every skill has awakenings? That's pretty cool, though. I like, I like, I really like that. That's pretty unique. Like the thing about this game, they try to branch off and be unique more than like uh, other games. Like if you see games like um, I don't know, uh, Blocks Piece and King Piece, those games are pretty much effectively the same game. I mean, of course, Blocks Piece came out first, I think, but like they're effectively the same games, pretty much. Like uh, th this game, like it tries to branch off and be different a little bit. I mean, the format's still the same, but it tries to be different and reward you guys and like be different. Like the little magic broom system. Uh, what else? What else? The little magic broom system. I mean, I know this game has codes. Uh, I think every sky has awakenings. I think. I don't know. I'm not sure. There's probably other stuff, but I just don't know them yet since like, it's my first time playing the game. Okay, this WXP is really hitting different. And the skills in this game are pretty dope. This dashing uppercut thing. And M1 combo, that, that thing looks really nice. Well, I will, I will say, this game is not... It's not bad. Like... If I'm ever doing like a live stream and I just want to like chill and grind, this is definitely the game I would come play. I mean, I wouldn't mind grinding this game. I probably will grind it just for the sake of having fun because like, I can probably just pull this game up and grind while like watching anime or something on my second monitor. I don't know. I can just do anything. So I, I don't mind grinding this game out. Like if you guys really want to see more videos on this game, I, I really, I like, I know I say this a lot, but I really wouldn't mind grinding this game out if you guys want to see more videos on this game. If this video gets uh, 3k likes, I'll continue to grind this game out and upload more videos on it. But that's that's if you guys want to see. I'm not gonna make videos on the game if you guys don't want to see the game. It's all it's all on you guys. Just let me know down below in the comments. Mean combo. You hit the E into the R move. Oh my God, that's some mean damage. All right, I think we're done. 
Dude, I, I really like the skills in this game. I really want to see like more skills on this game. Like you hit the E move, it combos into like the R. It's really nice. It's really nice. Um, I'll tell you guys what. This game, like it, it's it's not bad. This game, like I don't think I don't think people can say this game is effectively bad. They may like they may not like the concept, but this game isn't bad because it, it tries to be different from other games. I, I definitely reward this game for the factor of that, or the devs for the fact of that. They they try to branch off and be different. Like if I was playing like I don't know King Piece or something or Blocks Piece, if I don't have a Doe Fruit, I can't fly. But in this game, they give you a free magic broom so you can just travel across islands so it won't be tedious and annoying to, like, play the game. Like, this game tries to reward you and, like, not... It, it rewards you for, like... It, it tries to make you comfortable. Like, it doesn't want to make it tedious to where you just leave the game. Like, if that was me right there, like, I would have just probably left the game because I don't want to sit here and have to sail over and over just to, like, get to a next quest and stuff. So they give you a, a free magic broom so it won't be annoying to travel. This game is it's not bad it's definitely not bad but there's a lot of bugs they gotta patch like that little island over there with that quest not working and stuff there's like just some bugs that just need to be patched out and ironed out um this game is definitely it's definitely not bad i see why it has a lot of players playing all right defeat seven gorillas i want to get more powers i can i can probably buy a new power and i have 250k uh, i'm gonna go check the shop real quick all right, we're here. Okay, the ability shop. Okay, what do they have for me? I have 250k, so I can't buy anything too crazy. I can buy gas from My Hero Academia. Bleach, what is all this? Mm, storm, what is this winter inferno? Uh, I, I kind of want to see what this storm and winter stuff is, though. But they're probably trash. I'll try storm out. It's probably trash, but who cares? Uh, 250, oh, you can buy stuff for Robux? Oh, okay. I, I didn't expect that. <laughs> I guess I was right. You can like buy stuff for Robux. Okay. It's pretty interesting, I guess. We're gonna buy this with cash. We don't want to spend a Robux on the game yet. Alright. Uh oh wait, not Robux. What the hell? <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> okay, we got gas. Uh this is a little stand arrow. Uh are you sure you want to use this special arrow which contains storm? Yes, I do. Acquired storm. Okay, this is storm. Ooh, what is this? Forceful push, impact smash. Uh, let's use one of those codes. Let's go back to the Discord. Uh, let's see. Um, I can tell this game is definitely going to get grindy. It's definitely a grind type game. It's definitely something that you just chill and play while like live streaming or something. Sub to IB main. Yeah, definitely sub to IB main. That dude's chill. Uh, forceful push. All right, it's the Q move, uh, impact smash, the R move. Oh, that's pretty cool. And what's the awakening? Yeah, everything in this game has awakenings. That's actually pretty nice. That's that's really nice. Okay, we got Thunderbolt. Whoa. Okay, the skills in this game look dope. Is this like a TP move? Wait, how far does this go? Static step? This is pretty dope. Yo, that's pretty dope. <laughs> All right, so I can just TP across the map? No, wait, how far does this go? Oh, great. <laughs> Whoops. Okay, I got I to gotta get back on the island. What the hell? Uh, let's TP all the way over there. Oh, damn. It's like, if anything's in the way, you won't TP there. Crap. I gotta get my broom. <laughs> Give me on my broom, bro. Wait, can I TP on the broom? Okay, no, I can't. Alright, okay, we're here. Okay, chain lightning. Let's see what this does. Ooh, okay. It's like spam stun. It's like a thunderbolt, but more spammed. It's not really like a chain lightning that hits multiple enemies. Or does it? Yeah, it's just thunderbolt, but spammed. It does- Oh, God, that does good damage. Static cage. Uh, I can't use static cage. Oh, I need, I need 250 mastery. Oh, I can't get that yet. I mean, I can use the rest of the codes, but I don't want to waste the codes on, like, this thing. And when I know, I know there's better, like, stuff to get. This game's not bad. I'll tell you guys that. This game definitely isn't bad. All right, let's go kill these gorillas. All right, so I gotta kill these gorillas. Um, is that thing dead? This thing does a lot of damage. Like, <laughs> I, I, I expected, like, honestly, I expected this thing to not be that good, but it's actually pretty good. Since, it, like, I thought it was, like, low price, so it wouldn't be that good, but it, it actually is. Alright, uh, let's put magic power skill points in. I can type the number right. Okay, I can. Uh, do I gotta rejoin for this or no? I'm pretty sure I don't. Okay. Oh, they gave me some good HP. I'm actually liking this game. This is definitely one of those games where you gotta, like, hurry up and get on, like, the grind for it because a game like Blocks Piece, if you don't, if you weren't grinding back then, it's gonna take you a while to, to hit the level cap. And the level cap in that game is, like, 1,500 or something. I don't know what it is now. But, like, if you didn't grind back then, if you can't keep up, you're gonna get left behind. Like, new content's gonna drop, like, new world and stuff, but you're not gonna be a high enough level to do it. So, like, this is definitely one of those games where you wanna, you need to grind now before like the low cap raises and then you're left behind and stuff so like i'm gonna grind this game out to the max level 
so I won't get left behind. <laughs> like, what happened with Blocks Piece? Like, Blocks Piece, I can't play the game. Because I'm, like, level, like, 300 and all the new content drops for, like, low 1,000 plus. And I'm too low level to do any of the stuff. So I'm definitely going to grind this game out and, like, uh, continue to play it. And probably make some videos on this. If you guys want to see videos on this, as I said, just make sure you hit that like button. I will do videos on this game, probably, since I'm going to grind it. But, yeah. Um... I don't know if I'm going to end this video here after doing this quest, but I probably will. I just want to check what's on the next island after right, this. Quest complete, level 31. And those double EXP things hit different, dude. Alright, so this is the EXP shop, stat point refund, uh, buy arrow, buy a rare arrow, give Grimrar, uh, rare soul, what are souls? Whoops, I don't want to buy this. And I got EXP boosters and stuff. I will say, this EXP booster helps a lot. Where's that boss at that I saw earlier? I kind of want to kill it, but I'm pretty sure I can't. Uh, pretty sure it was I will say one thing that needs to get added to this game is like a little map to tell you like uh what island you're supposed to be on and stuff. That probably handholds people way too much, but it it definitely helps a lot. Um, this is the boss right here. What island? What level is this island? Honestly, like I need set spawner. Yeah. Um, what bot? What level is this dude? And Neil, isn't that his name again? Yeah, Neil. 300? Yo, he wouldn't tap me. <laughs> Alright, so that's pretty much it for this video. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna grind this game too much on camera, because it's definitely one of those games that you're not supposed to really grind on camera, because it's gonna be boring for you guys to watch. So I'm gonna end this video here. I'm gonna grind this game off camera. Make sure, uh, let me know what you guys think about this game down below in the comments. I'm gonna, uh, probably upload another video today. Probably. Not promising anything. But yeah, I'll see you guys later. If I'm not uploading another video today, I'm probably gonna live stream later tonight if i'm not playing a uh, deep woken uh like subscribe comment notifications and i'll see you guys later Watch out.